Good afternoon, travelers. Tea Leaf here. And today I think we're going to go on a nice long walk to Little Slip. We're going to visit my favorite tea house in the game. It's called Voices Tavern. And there's just a lot going on in Little Slip that I really enjoy with, and that, and that makes this my favorite place to go in the game. So come along. Let's go to Little Slip. This is going to be a fairly easy path. It's just a long one. Um, we're just going to follow these train tracks, actually. We're just going to go all the way west, as far as we can go. And we can't get lost because we're just going to follow these railroad. It looks like here, these ruins, you know, Braided Shore must be a very old place. I wonder what was here, which is now just rubble. There's a lot of, a lot of places like this. I mean, if you've ever visited the Underbelly, especially, that place is massive. And all underground, it just makes you wonder what, what was here before our time. It's a lot of mystery in Braided Shore. Again, we're just following these tracks. We got some company. I see a lot of deer in this area.
had to take a screenshot there, sorry for that. Couldn't help myself. That's the tea house there in the distance. Looks Kind of looks like it's floating on the water. Uh, that's the Voices Tavern. There's an interesting little peninsula here that I can walk out on and uh, there's people on that boat that you can speak with. We'll do that in another video. But again, this is just one of my favorite places to come to. Um, you can tell it's just beautiful. I love it being right on the water. Love the wilderness around it. The nice calming sounds of nature. I've done a lot of fishing here just to take in the peaceful scenery. And if you ever want to level your fishing, it's a great place to come to. Sometimes there's a, there's a guard standing here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Doesn't appear to be one today. But depending on where you want to explore around this area, if you venture off the road, you'll find some NPCs and some people uh, might be looking for some, some help. I'll give you a little quest or two. I think there's a, a moss walker over there. I can actually see behind that tree. <clears throat> I don't know if you guys spotted him. But we're just going to keep walking here because we are just about at the Voices Tavern. So it's a good lengthy walk from where we came from, but it's just so peaceful and lovely. I love the way the scenery changes when we first start following the tracks, the railroad tracks, and it's kind of like an open plain, and it turns into a dense wilderness, and, and now this. One of the reasons I love this tea house so much compared to the others they're all great, but this one, as you can tell, it's pretty quiet. And Talif Rasper kind of likes, kind of likes it that way. <laughs> there's not a lot of people here. There's like a couple of workers. There's not much going on during the day, as you can tell. I rarely run into other travelers here as well. But, if you come here at night, especially this area back here in particular, which I'll go to now, um, it, can, it can get quite busy. You'll come here and you'll see a bunch of people sitting back here at nighttime, and they'll all be playing the game of Passage. It's like a little gambling game that you can play in Braided Shore against certain NPCs, and there's one that actually visits here at nighttime who's very interesting. We'll have to introduce you to him at some point. We'll have to show the other areas that are connected to Little Slip as well. It's quite the, there's a lot going on here and it's, uh, it's quite the little place to hang out. I love it. So I think I'll take advantage of this jade brew that they've left out here for travelers. I'll get some stamina back, rejuvenate a little bit. Thank you all for coming along with me on this journey. And hopefully uh, you'll be around for the next one. <laughs>